James, congratulations, made in half century for Sussex, you must be delighted. Yeah, no, definitely. Uh, dream come true. Um, I've been thinking about it for a very long time, like, had, had a couple close calls uh, against Kent last year, it was 30 odd and 20, yeah, but it's really nice to finally cross that milestone. And how much uh, cricket are you looking to play this year? I know you finished school now, so is it just a case of playing as much as you can this summer? Yeah, definitely. I'm making myself available for everything possible, so hopefully playing as much as I can. Um, try to try play as much championship cricket as I can, because that's the format I'm really loving at the moment. And obviously, hopefully the Royal London as well. Um, gave that a good go last year, so hopefully it'll be the same this year. And let's talk about that team effort to get 588. We really batted all the way down the order, even down to Sean Hunt. He gave you great support as well. How confident was that? Did that make you feel when everyone was making runs? No, no, it was amazing. Like I, I think if you look at the scorecard, no, no one didn't contribute in that whole inning. So it was amazing to see. Um, and it, it, it's just credit. Like we're, we're all buzzing so well. Everyone wants everyone to do well for each other. And it's just one of those that you can just feel in the dressing room that no one's sour about other people's you know, achievements and it's just really nice and like, everyone wants to do well for each other. Um, obviously Tommy's batted extremely well first day and the openers set a really good platform for us, unfortunately about Hainsey not, not doing the best but I think those two set the tone, like Ali like, batted unbelievably and I just think that it just echoed through the whole change room how we were, like, the conversations going on, it was just yeah, real good. And then let's talk about when we come out to bowl. It was obviously a brilliant start, Finney, with the, mm. with the first uh, wicket from the first ball. Yeah. Then Kimber and Patel have obviously put on a bit of a partnership there. What's the feeling in the dressing room about the kind of the state of the game now, and, and are we confident we can still go on and get this win? Yeah, I, I, there's there's no way we can't win this game. Like we we obviously know it's a quick, uh, really good pitch, but we know with with Hove, like the wicket is coming clusters. Like we just got to be patient for a little while. But as that last half an hour showed, we were really good. Um, and we just got to have moments like those where I think they got one run off like four overs, I think, or six overs. Um, and it was something real good from those last two at the end. So, and it's starting to reverse swing, so it's definitely going to get a lot harder for them. Yeah, let's talk about the pitch. Obviously, there's a lot been said it's a very good pitch and it's very good batting conditions. But mm. was there enough in there for you for the next two days to give you optimism that there would be some turn and maybe some bounce to take some wickets? No, definitely. I think there was, I got a few to go quite big towards the end of my spell, which is really, really reassuring to see. And I think, uh, obviously, Parkinson getting a five for it shows that there's obviously something in it. Um, so, yeah, hopefully we'll see how it goes.